Hello everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm back with the weekly reads. This is going to be for the sign of Taurus. This reading is for the second week of June, start from the 8th through the 14th of June 2021. And um, I will be adding charms, I will be pulling out oracle cards as well, so stay tuned. And uh, before we dive into the read, let me remind you it's a general reading, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there, so always pick the messages which are resonating and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings. So Taurus, let's find out what can you expect coming up for you for this week time, which has already started. Let's find out what can be coming up for you guys for this week time. The karma. Going back to somebody uh, that you were destined to be with, especially when it comes to a love life situation, I do see you having a reconciliation with the past person or a reunion with a past person. Uh, maybe you were never apart from them on a soul level, but yes, there has been some gap distance between the two of you. So the prayers, affirmations are definitely getting rewarded and you are getting your answered, uh, your prayer answered. Now, um, it was, it was this time to come you know it, it was this time to come for some of you you were so sure that it's gonna happen maybe the timing was uh you know uh kind of out for some of you but for others of you you were expecting it to come this very time let's take more cards two of swords i feel like you know it was pretty much in your own hands to to go for it or not um there were certain decisions that you had to make to to pursue whatever it is that you are pursuing now so somebody is definitely getting their prayers answered there. Uh, it can be you, it can be them who manifested you back or the reunion and this connection. So whoever got this reunion manifested, eventually you guys are getting, man uh, uh, getting back into union with each other. So your souls have been missing each other badly is what I'm picking up because your souls have always been tied each other maybe there was like you know a um, physical distance between the two of you but your souls were always connected um, like I said it, it was something um, that was supposed to happen way back in times but for some of you you waited for so long um, I feel like you know for majority of you it's um you took your time to decide your person has been waiting on for you. I feel like, you know, they were the one who wished, prayed for it. When it comes to you, you were not sure about this decision of yours, about this connection. And, you know, your, for some of you, you might have to travel away from where you are living just to pursue your love. Uh, maybe that has been the issue or the reason why you could not take that decision earlier. But finally, you are taking that decision. I do see you making a move towards your specific someone which you never got your time and attention to earlier. Finally, you are deciding you are reaching out to this person and you are talking to them and then there is no way going back away from each other. Um, this whole situation caused a lot of uh, stress in your life though. Uh, the time apart from each other was not something ideal, but uh, you... Um, <sighs> Somehow it was meant to happen this way, maybe. Um, you always had this thing that you don't have time for it. The energies could be completely reversed for some of you as well, but uh, that's what I'm picking up. Things are changing now, things are definitely shifting. Temperance. Um, you have waited for it to happen. You have waited for it. Your person has been trying to manifest this reunion with you, and um, finally they are getting it manifested. They are... Uh, wow they never gave up on this connection even though you were not putting effort into this connection they still were waiting for you and that's what it is like you know your person loves you so much so so much to the point where they never gave up on the connection even when you were not in the picture for them they stick to you they stick to their dream about you meditate on friday maybe they are the ones who are meditating on fridays to get you back in their life as well if you want your person to be back to you, maybe you can start using meditations on Friday as well. <clears throat> they somehow believed that the, you guys were destined to be together forever. They have made a wish around it and now they are getting the wish fulfilled. Uh, back in the divine light, uh, spending some time in the, in the nature is going to help you a lot. Ending a tough cycle and healing the connection. 
you know what to do next follow your intuition um work on your confidence um value yourself and move on for some of you you might have uh, you might have uh, been like you know pulling uh yourself away from making that decision because you were not confident in yourself around this person around this connection uh maybe you believe that you were not going to be accepted by your person for some of you because uh because maybe you chose to move on in the past from them so you had your own personal fears and you know traumas to deal with around it but then finally you are believing in it and you're working towards it and you're going towards your specific someone as what i'm picking up so yeah let's see more cards here let's see what else do we have coming up for you for this week time but there is definitely a union of two souls happening and that too from the past give space let there be closeness between you but always give each other space love never claims it simply allows and gives that's exactly what your person could have been doing lately like you know they they just gave you the space that you wanted they patiently waited for you to come forward one day and that's exactly what is happening now so it's it's like you know they they never claimed you to be you know doing this and that uh they never you know ask you to to understand things they just believe that one day you will one day you will come back to them and that's their confidence in in the connection in the in the love that they have for you so if you really um if you are a cross watcher or you feel the energies are reversed you have to be confident in your love that you have for a specific someone because one day you will get that person back if you believe in yourself and if you believe in the love that you have for this person they will come back um awakening change the way you are looking at the situation embrace your uniqueness and a temporary pause in the action wow i feel like you know this awakening in this connection was a must you know this time apart made things very clear for uh for the one who was not readily accepting this connection or giving into this connection was not something that they were uh you know uh, pursuing earlier they had to take this pause because otherwise things would have been different and now when you guys are coming back together it's going to be all together a different experience you you cannot even imagine how mature this connection will be how beautiful the energies will be um I feel like you know this connection is or has been very protected by the divine itself uh, divine itself and plus I feel like you know the person that you are dealing with they are very much close to the divine they are somebody who meditates a lot who wishes a lot who prays a lot who affirms a lot so let's see the chance yes affirmations could be used uh, could have been you know affirmations could have been the thing that your person used uh, as well things are changing for better in this connection you are always in my heart this person always loved you and you also love them that's the reason why you are going back to the love of your life because that's how um you just took your time to decide but then you are going back to the one that you love for sure so yeah this pretty much it coming up for you for this read if the reading resonates with you to like subscribe and share if you're willing to get a personal read you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you guys take care and bye bye